Greetings Grand Arts, it's Principal Christian with my message for the week of September 26th. I just want to remind everyone that we do not have school on Monday, so it's an unassigned day and we will see all of our students back on Tuesday. This week I'm really excited to present uh, a very special guest, a very important person to us here on campus, our amazing, illustrious Dean, Ms. Cushing! Thank you, Ms. Christian. It's so nice to see all of you this week um, in September. I can't believe it's almost the end of September already. It's wild. This month has flown by. Wild. So uh, we have some wonderful resources here at Cortinas, and I want to make sure everyone knows what they are so that we can all take advantage of them. And we're actually standing in one right now. So I don't know if you guys know where this is on campus, but this is actually right next door to where my office is in the Dance Academy workroom on the fourth floor of the main building here on campus. And um, I don't know, what do you think? Well, what are some of the things that, how can students access some of these resources? Because I see like toothpaste, a toothbrush, tissue, clothes, soap, all the great things. These yeah. are awesome. So we've collected a bunch of different resources and we're always taking donations. So if you're cleaning out your closet or your parents are asking how they can help the school, we're always accepting donations for the space. And it's meant to be for students. If let's say you forgot a pair of gym shorts, but you don't want to lose out on your lesson for the day, or let's say you need a deodorant or a reusable water bottle because mm -hmm. you're thirsty mm -hmm. or any clothes at all, um, all of this is free and available for students, all students, uh, all the time. Thank you. I'm really excited to see this and it's, it just keeps growing, so this is exciting. Yeah, so we hope you guys will come check us out here in the Dance Academy workroom if you're in, in need of any supplies. Hey, you know what I'd love? I'd love to check out your office. Okay, let's go there next. I love this space. It's just so exciting. There's so many wonderful little tidbits to see about who you are and I think what makes you such a great member of our family here at Grand Arts. Thank I would you. love to hear more about some of the ways that we you support students and support our entire school um, to ensure that you know we have a positive learning environment. Definitely. So as the dean, I have to say sometimes I get a bad rap because people think when they come to my office they're in trouble, but that's not always true. Um, I help students with a variety of things. Really, my job is about supporting students so that they can be the most successful here at Grand Arts. And so, one of the things I added to my office, which is a crowd pleaser, is snacks. Because when you're hungry, you can, it's really hard to think and learn. Um, yeah. That brings them in, that draws the crowds. It brings me in too. It brings, I mean, okay. understand. I come for the snacks as well. Yes. Um, and some of the areas I do help kids with is, we've had a lot of instances this year where kids are having difficulty with their peers, mm -hmm. either in class or sometimes online. Mm -hmm. um, and I, can understand kids haven't had the chance to practice their skills because we've been in a pandemic and so we coach kids on how to work with their peers and how to resolve conflict in a way that's not punitive they're not in trouble we're right. trying to help them build their skills I love that yeah I think it's really really important it is and I think also like one of the other resources that I I know you're pretty um, you're a central player with is our two pay program and that we have some interventions and 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 the two pay program really provides supports for students that um, you know are you know have experience with vaping or looking to you know live a healthier lifestyle, and so I'd love to just talk a little bit about what are some of the opportunities that are there, just so we can share with our community and our families if they feel like, hey, this might be a resource that they would like to engage with. Definitely. So mm -hmm. our school was awarded a two pay grant, uh, which stands for Tobacco Use Prevention Education, and it covers all substances. And this is the third year of our grant implementation. And it's designed to support students in making healthy choices. And again, it's not, if you decide you wanna take advantage of this resource, it's not that you're in trouble, it's that we're trying to help you uh, and support you. And so through the Two Pay program, we offer brief intervention, which is just a supportive conversation that they can have with me or another staff member, just to explore like the reasons why they might be experimenting with substance use, some of the healthy alternatives, how it might impact their family and their, their friend relationships. Um, and we know, especially with what's going on in the world right now and how, how important it is for us to keep our students safe. And so it's really, really important to me um, that we give kids the supports when they're trying to make healthy choices. Um, so yeah, of course. And we also have the Wellbeing Center on yeah. campus, which is another great resource. Kids can actually self-identify and go to the Wellbeing Center. Um, and it is a adult 
staff free space. Like they have their own staff, of course, but you're not gonna be in there, I'm not gonna be in there. So kids can have a sense of security and a little bit of, um, you know, they don't always want the adults there. You know what I'm yeah, trying to say? Like, yeah. So we got different options for kids. That's excellent. Yeah. And thank you so much for everything you do for our campus. And it's just been great working with you so far. You're very Thanks, safe. Thanks everyone. You. Have a great week.